If you create a lot of how-to videos and tutorials, Filmora 14 is a really useful video editing software for that purpose. I create a lot of how-to videos related to Microsoft Excel and they help me a lot. And specifically when it comes to zooming in on specific elements to, to focus on. So for example, here I've got an Excel video and I'm typing in a formula at this stage. So it would be really useful at this point to zoom in specifically on that cell so that people can see what they should be focusing on and they can clearly see the formula that I'm keying in. So how do I do this? So once I'm keying in this formula or the, the moment where I want to zoom in, I'm going to set up a keyframe. So on this transform section over here, so with my clip selected, I'm going to click this button to create a keyframe and I'm going to adjust the scale. So it zooms in and then just the Y axis and move the X axis as well, just so it's really clear. So now when people see this, they can see what I'm entering in for my formula. And once I'm done with this, let's create another keyframe and then I can zoom out. Now, the one thing I want to do though, is I want to have a quick zoom in and zoom out effect because right now, I, right now it's zoomed in in this entire screen and that's not what I want. So just before I've got this keyframe, I want to add another keyframe. So I'm going to click this button and I'm going to hit this reset button here. So it zooms out entirely. So now when I hit the button, it's going to start from here and now zoom into that. But let's say I want it to be a bit snappier and quicker. I'm going to hold control and use my scroll wheel on my mouse to zoom in on this clip a little bit more and now drag this point here so it's a bit closer to that other key point keyframe and now when I play my video now it's going to zoom in a lot quicker so it has that nice effect where it's going in dramatically really quickly and I'm going to do the same thing when I'm done with the clip and I want to zoom out so over here this is my other my other keyframe I'm going to add another one here click this button reset it and again zoom in and make that gap really small. So depending on how small that gap is or how big, that's gonna determine the speed at which you move out. So if it's a big gap, it's gonna be really slow. If it's a tight, narrow gap, it's gonna be a quick zoom out effect. So if I play this video again, you can see really quick and snappy. And so if at a later point, I also want to do this as well. For example, over here, I've got another area where I'm typing in a formula. I'm just gonna zoom out a little bit more here. So here I'm here we go. Here I'm entering another format. So instead of trying to set this up exactly again, what I'm doing is add another keyframe. But what I'm going to do is take this other one that I created. So I've got this 288%. I'm, I'm going to hit Control C and apply that right here. Control V. And now it applies that setting right there. So I don't have to worry about adjusting this again. I can, I can tweak this if I want to, if I want to adjust my X position or my Y position but it makes it really easy to just copy the exact uh, place that I was at before. And then again, so once I'm done with this, so let's say right around here, control V, and now let's add that zoom out effect, a keyframe to reset, keyframe to reset as well. So now by setting that up, it makes it really quick and snappy to make sure that that zoom effect happens really quickly focusing on that specific cell. So for tutorials, this is really helpful because, you know, when someone's viewing a tutorial or a how-to guide, they may be overwhelmed with information, not sure what to focus on. And if you zoom in on a specific area of your screen, that can make that process a whole lot easier. So you're making sure that they're focusing on um, the area that you're covering at, at that moment in time. So it's a really cool um, thing to set up in Filmora 14. It's really easy to do with the keyframes. All you're doing is creating a new keyframe at that point, zooming into that effect, and then making sure you, you're using that reset button here so it zooms out and then you can dictate, you know, how quickly or how long you want that zoom effect to apply. So with Filmora 14, it's a really great software for editing, editing your videos, especially if you're doing tutorials and how-to guides. So check it out, use the, use the keyframes, and that can really help you in your editing process, especially with tutorials to be able to make it them easy to understand for your viewers.